Hollow Sun Optics. Are these on? Yep, that one's on. That one's on. Cool. Hollow Sun Optics. Let's see. So here we have the 507C and the 508T. They're both great. Uh, I don't really know what you might want. I do prefer the 508. Um, my preference. But they have the same footprint. They're both RMR cuts. Uh, they both have backup solar panels. Those do not charge, but they will keep this thing running should you have enough light. They're both 2MOA. They both use the same type of battery. They both have the same adjustments for windage and elevation. Their thicknesses are about the same. Their controls, functions, reticles are all the same. The 508 is a bit more blacked out, so you don't have coloring on your branding versus the 507C that does. Um, the main reason I prefer it is one for the uh, discrete branding, but also the window. I do prefer the squared window over the curved window. Now, if you're talking about uh, picking up and having to use that solar panel, the curve could actually give you an advantage because it's allowing more light from more angles to come in instead of just uh, a flat top. Now, I like them both. I've tried them both. I have them both. I'm a big fan of both of them. If I had to pick one, I'm picking the 508T for the two reasons that I said, uh, which are really the two big differences here. Again, they run on the same battery. They're the same footprint. They're the same everything, except one is more discreet and square. One is less discreet and rounded. That, that's it. Same battery life, I believe. Same material, I believe. Yeah, I do like this. Now, some people might say, well, why would you get the 508T instead of the, what is it, the 507 Comp? That's like a massive window. There's a lot I can say about that. I don't think the comp is worth it. If you do, great. Uh, the main reason I say that is I have an SRO, Trijicon SRO. Very big window. Uh, in fact, it's like the circular version of the 507 comp. They're both very large windows. I actually don't like it. I think it's more distracting than it is helpful. I don't think the window needs to be huge which is actually one reason why I think the, the Aimpoint Acro. A lot of people complain about the window being too small. And I don't think that's a, a big deal. You need to be using your optic properly. You're not focusing on your dot. You're looking through that thing. So you, in this scenario right here, you shouldn't be focusing on that dot. You should be focusing on the table and overlaying that dot onto it. So if your presentation is good and you're able to acquire that site every time you present, window size doesn't matter. I actually found that the larger the window size, the more distracting it was instead of just being able to focus on the optic. Anyways, uh, yeah, 508T, I think it's a really great optic. That being said, I also think the 507C is also a great optic. This is the X2, by the way. And yeah, X2. Uh, very good optics. Either way, you won't be disappointed. They are great.